Hey y'all, it's your girl Tashonda Renee and I'm back with another video. In today's video, I'm making the viral sweet potato honey bun pound cake. So if you would like to see how I do it, please stay tuned. All right, this cake is super easy to make. You're gonna need a yellow box cake mix. I'm using Betty Crocker, but you can use your favorite. To that, you're gonna add eight ounces of sour cream. And you do wanna let that sit out for a little while. Um, just make sure it's at room temperature. Then you're gonna add four large eggs. And those are also at room temperature. You're gonna add about two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Then you're gonna add three fourths cup of vegetable oil. This next part is optional. I wanted my cake to be orange. Um, so I did have some red and yellow food coloring. So I mixed some of that together to get a light orange color. I started with two drops of red and three drops of yellow. Um, but again, that part is totally optional. You do not have to color your cake. So once you have all the ingredients in the mixing bowl, you're just going to go ahead and mix that. I'm using my stand mixer, but you definitely don't need a stand mixer to mix this. I'm going to mix it on about a medium speed for about two minutes. And then I'm going to scrape the size of the bowl down and then add one cup of mashed sweet potatoes. I'm going to go ahead and mix that until I can get it as smooth as possible. It takes about another two minutes. Now that that's all mixed together, you're going to go ahead and make your brown sugar and cinnamon mixture. You're going to add one cup of light brown sugar to a bowl. To that, you're going to add some cinnamon, about a teaspoon or more if you love cinnamon, and just a dash of nutmeg. And then you're just going to mix that together until it's well incorporated. Now you wanna go ahead and add about half of your cake mix to your baking dish. I'm using a 12 by nine dish. And be sure to spray it with the nonstick cooking spray first. Now you wanna go ahead and add your brown sugar and cinnamon mixture. And you wanna be sure to cover the first layer of cake mix completely. Then you're gonna go ahead and add the second layer of cake mix. Spread that as evenly across the top as you can. Then you're gonna go ahead and add that to your oven. You do wanna preheat your oven to 350 degrees and you're gonna bake your cake for at minimum 35 minutes. You do wanna start checking it around 35 minutes. Oven temps may vary from oven to oven, so just start checking it around 35 minutes. Okay, so the last step is to make your glaze for the top of your honey bun cake. And I'm gonna use about one and a half cups of powdered sugar and a couple tablespoons of milk. Mix that together and that is the glaze. If you find that your glaze is too thin, you just need to add more sugar. If it's too thick, just, just add a little more milk. Now you're just gonna go ahead and pour your glaze over your hot cake and spread it evenly with the spoon or spatula. And then your cake is completely done. And y'all, this cake is really good. I think you and your family will enjoy it if you give it a try. Um, it's perfect for the upcoming holidays. If you like sweet potatoes, you're gonna love this cake. The use of the sour cream and the sweet potatoes really does make this a moist cake. It is very good. I do believe this is a must try for sweet potato lovers.
And on the other hand, if you're not a sweet potato lover, I also have a regular honey bun cake on my channel. Be sure to check out the description box below. I'll have a list of everything I use to make this cake listed down there. And I'll also have the regular honey bun cake video listed down there as well. If you have not already done so, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you be a part of my YouTube family. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.